Hello everyone and welcome back. If you remember in the last episode, I said this episode was going to be concentrating on doing an end raid. And that is what we're going to be doing today. We've made our way over to the end fortress. I think it's what these things are called. Uh, but the end portal is around here somewhere. Uh, I haven't been here before. Um, this was the library, I'm assuming, and... It says exit. Um, let's see if we can find this thing. It's usually right around where the library was. Um, apparently somebody's done something. Yep, there it is right there. Uh, the endermite. Oh no, the endermites. I hear the endermites. We have to build a platform. If you build a platform up, uh, even with this thing, I think with the endermites spawn they go down ah oh there's lava down there there's a hole why is there a hole in the floor there should never be a hole in the floor with lava underneath it oh goodness this place needs a little bit of work obviously but uh let's see we're gonna go back out so anytime you're going into the end it's always a good idea to set a bed down uh let's go back in this room here don't want to let the villagers out i don't know what they're doing over here with the villagers and the library uh, but somebody's got a plan, but we're going to put a bed down, and we're going to set our respawn point here. Um, that way we don't have to travel all the way back when we die. And I say when we die, because very rarely... What are you doing, buddy? You can't get out of there. Stay in there. You try to shut me in. I've seen that. Anyway, I always die during these trips into the end. Uh, it's kind of unavoidable, but we're geared up. We've got some... Potions of Slow Falling, which helps uh, when you're raiding the end cities and you get shot if you can't get to a ledge or something to get underneath when the shulkers shoot you with their levitating bombs. These things really help when you fall. Um, if you've never used Potion of Slow Falling, they're awesome. They really, really come in handy when you're fighting the Ender Dragon. Uh, we brought some wood. We brought an Ender Chest. Uh, we brought some chests. When we start getting shulker shells, we can start making shulker boxes right off the bat and put any of our loot that we find in the end cities in our end chest that way if we do die we don't have to go back and pick it all up um man these ender mites are all over the place anyway let's go ahead and get in and see what it looks like in here uh what kind of okay so we got a room spawning sometimes you spawn just on a wide open pad let's see what they've done here okay all right, so there's one portal. Oh, oh, I looked at him. I looked at him. Right off the bat, we looked at the Enderman. We're going to need to kill a few Endermen and get some Enderpearls so we can actually get through the gateway. Um, so we're going to start off by doing that. But um, let's get that out of the way. Where did he go? All right, I think he calmed down. The first thing I want to do is fix this little stairway. Um, that bunny hopping thing is not cool to me. So I'm going to go ahead and make a stairway going up. Let me get that done and I'll come right back. Okay, so we've cleaned up the spawn in pad just a little bit. Uh, like I say, I just like to clean up things as I go. Uh, I know other people are concentrating on other things. So this is one of the things that I wanted to do for the server when I joined is just help clean up things. Um, you've got... A specific thing that you're doing sometimes you go through and you just kind of do what you can to get to where you need to be and then you go and do your thing and then I'll just come along and just clean everything up which is silent and neat. so I put the inner chest down here that was there put a couple of chests here just to put stuff in in case you don't want to you know when you come in if we respawn the dragon you come in you can put extra stuff in here and that way it'll be there when you spawn back in so we've got to Kill a few Endermen now and get some Ender Pearls so we can get through the gateway. And I can already tell you, uh, we're going to clean up that gateway. Also, if we can get a couple of these guys to aggro on us. Um, I really don't need fire aspect. Well, there we go. There's a couple right off the bat. I really don't need fire aspect on this sword when I'm fighting Endermen because uh, it makes them teleport. Uh, come on. Come on. Come on. Stop running around. Let's see if we can do it with our... Um, there we go. We got three now. Uh, that'll be good enough. 
So let me tell you what, we're going to go ahead and get through the gateway and we will come back and clean that up after we get through with this today because this is going to be a long process. Getting out there, finding in cities, uh, very long process. Definitely going to do it in a time lapse kind of deal. Um, we're wow, this is not safe for me because I fall off of stuff. All right, we're crouched down. Let's go through and see what we get. And there's another inner chest there. Are you kidding me? This is how it spawned the gateway off in the void. So we know somebody's went that way, somebody's went that way. Let's see, this is going back negative, so that's back toward the main island. So we are going to have to follow one of these pathways to get to a city because I don't think we have enough to bridge out. So I like to bring blocks because I like to bridge out to different places. Um, but I'm used to the first gateway spawning you in on a pretty big island, but this just spawned us out into the void, which is... Wow, that's just, uh, this is not a good place to spawn. So let's go this way for now, and we'll come back when we find a bigger island. Okay, it wasn't that far to get to the first island, but now that we're here, um, I'm going to go ahead and gather up some more end stone, just so we've got enough blocks to bridge out. Uh, it looks like somebody went off in that direction. You can see the torches going and that looks like they do what I like to do also when I get to the first big island I just like to go around the edges um, if I go all the way around and come back to where I started um, I'll usually go back to where I see the first island off in the distance and I'll bridge out to there and you just kind of keep working your way around these islands until you find an in city um, it's a very long and arduous process to get through uh, nobody likes doing it um, but Get those shulker boxes and those elytras, you have to. So we're going to go ahead and gather up some blocks. We're going to get into a time lapse. Hope you enjoy it. Uh, we'll see how long it takes us to find our first end city. I'm not sure if I can put a timer up on uh, the screen. I will try to put a timer up just so we can kind of time it as we're going through the time lapse. And um, we'll see what happens. So stick around. Well, that did not take nearly as long as I was expecting. Um, oh boy, we got an Enderman on us already. Oh, come on, I didn't look at you, dude. Where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? Where's he at? Did he calm down already? Where is this little guy at? Oh, he's out on the ground. Uh-oh, did I look at another Enderman? Well, that's a rough way to start off. Here we go, let's see. No, stop teleporting. Ah. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? He's, ah. He's up on the tree. I've never seen one on the tree before. Let's take him out of the boat. Ah. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Go away, stupid Enderman. A pumpkin on the head would definitely have helped. I don't know why I didn't bring a jack-o'-lantern. Um, I usually do. 
but we can do this without a jacket liner. Get wrecked. All right, let's go see if this guy dropped a shell. He did indeed drop a shell. So that's one shell. Now we got to find these other little guys. I don't see him. All right, let's get on up into the tower. I'll try to make my commentary decent on this, but as you guys know, when I start concentrating, I get very quiet. Um, let's see, where are you at? Where are you at? I hear you on the outside. I'm on the outside. And I do this this way because I am no good at parkour. So I just build me a little stairway as I go. I want to know where this guy is on the outside. That's bugging me. Where are you at, little dude? Ah. Uh, I didn't look at you. Go away. I didn't look at you. Go away. Let's go up one more level. He's got to be on the roof. Ah. Yeah, he's got to be on the roof. Let's go up onto the roof. Did he drop a shell for us? He did. Ah! That was no good. Um, this is where we need this at. Alright. Potion of Slow Falling engaged. Ah, uh, that's so much better than just falling down and dying. Alright, so we've got two shulker shells already, so we can make our first shulker box. But let's work our way on up, because this in city also has a ship from the two shulkers on the outside of the entrance. I don't think this place has been raided yet. Uh, oh no, already into this place. Probably could have used some better armor for this too. Go away, 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 go away. All right. All right, let's deal with these guys. Let's deal with these guys. Alright. It would be nice to be using our looting sword on this because the loot tables for the shulkers, I believe, are now active. Yeah. But we're trying not to die, so. Yeah, there you go. Come on up here to me. Alright, let's see. We've got two minutes on our feather falling. Not feather falling, um, pushing a slow falling. Let's see here. How many shells did we get? One out of all that, we only got one shell. Unless I missed one on a shelf somewhere. There's one there. Um, I hear him, he must be on the outside. All right, let's tower our way back up. Now let's go and see if we can find the ship. And I completely forgot to bring rockets. One of the most important things I was not going to forget is the rockets. Because once we get that first set of elytra, we can just fly around and look for NCs. But I forgot the rockets. Um, so we could get our first, we could actually go back, get our first set of elytra, go back get some rockets and come back in. We could also go ahead and put unbreaking and mending on that elytra. Because we still have a few of those books left from the trading hall. Alright. First loot chest. Thorns 2. That's pretty good. Emeralds. A mending pickaxe. That's awesome. And we don't really need the saddle. We've got more saddles than we know what to do with from fishing. Alright. Let's get on up this tower. And I'll come back.
Okay, so we found the ship entrance, and I don't think I've ever seen an in-city like this to where um, it's over, usually you bridge out here, uh, but this one's actually got a tower that's in the middle of it. This is kind of unusual. Um, I'm not sure how to get into that tower, um, but we're going to take another potion of slow falling, and we're going to try to get over to this boat. First, we're going to take out these little guys so they don't make us float. Oh, poop. Oh, poop. That was not good. But we got our potion of slow falling. We got our potion of slow falling. We're good. We're, well, that was... Hey, that was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Now, to see... Yes, there are elytra here. And we get our second loot boxes so far of the city. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, nice. Look at that. Seven diamonds, some iron, and some gold. That was awesome. Oh, another diamond. Oh, another four diamonds. That's 11 diamonds already, and we've just got started. And we've got a blast protection for mending. All right. Um, so... With that, we don't want to lose these before we get back out of here. So what we're going to do, um, we're going to set up our crafting table that we seem to not have. There it is. All right. We're going to set up our crafting table. We're going to craft up some shulker boxes. Um, don't need that. Um, let's see what we want to do. We want to put our in chest down, put our shulker box down, and let's throw some stuff in here. That, 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 that. Um, let's see what else do we want to do in here. We got another shulker box. So let's make up some, let's make some room in. All right, let's make some room. Let's throw this, 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 this. This, this. Um, let's see what else we want to put in there. Go ahead and throw our diamonds in there. Go. Minute 45 seconds. I wanted to get back out of here before that slow falling ran out, so I don't really waste it. Uh, that's a nice diamond haul. Let's go ahead and put our... We don't need more than two shulker boxes now. Let's go ahead and put those in there. Let's clean out some more. Put our tools in this one with our elytra. Um, let's see. That, we're going to leave that accessible. And yes, I brought some dye to go ahead and dye my shulker boxes. And boom, boom goes the dynamite. Alright, let's throw these in the end chest. And let's get the heck out of Dodge. I did not bring an axe. So, um, pretty successful for our first end city. We've got some shulker boxes already. Um, we're going to grab these. Potion of instant health. we got to find these shulkers, these last little bit of shulkers. Where are you guys at? did get one from there and of course we're not going to forget the dragon head let's go back down almost forgot it and I like to just do this I go out build a platform bridge out a little bit um, not far enough go two more I like to go out two to the sides. This thing will fall very easily. And I think our potion of slow falling just ran out. We got plenty, so we're gonna take one more before we head off after we get the dragon head. Yes. Now we're gonna get out of Dodge. We're going to actually go back over to the city, and 
can we make that jump? No. Um, so I want to go back up in here and get a few more shulker shells. And uh, let me do that, and we'll come back and figure out if we're going to go keep going or if we're going to go back out, get our elytra enchanted up with some books, and come back with some rockets and see if we can find some more cities. But, well, I think we cleaned out almost all the shulkers. There may be one stray one. I couldn't find him. He was growling and doing his thing over there, but I could not find him. So for this city, uh, we did pretty good. We got a diamond helmet set of elytra, a diamond chest plate, diamond boots. We got some iron, we got an iron chest plate, some iron boots. That's got feather falling four on it, which is not bad. We also found a killer shovel, efficiency five, unbreaking three, fortune three, mending one. That was a great find. We got a fortune three, efficiency four diamond shovel, and we've got a mending pickaxe that we can add other enchantments to. We also got some banners. I missed one. I knocked eight off, but I missed one. Uh, I went ahead and grabbed a few end rods. We found some diamond or uh, gold horse armor, rather. Uh, and we found a lot of gold. We found a lot of diamonds. I think we found, what, 11, 12 diamonds? And we got 24 plus 4, 28 shulker shells because we made these two shulker boxes. Um, so 28 shulker shells from one city is not bad. Um, but... We accomplished what we wanted to accomplish. Now, I'm going to work my way back over to the gateway, and we're going to go ahead and leave the inn. Um, honestly, I was really expecting it to take a lot longer. I mean, a lot longer to find an inn city. I've never found one in this close, I don't think, uh, especially not this big. I think one realm I played on, I found a single tower right within a hundred blocks, maybe less, of the first gateway that we went through. Um, but finding one this big with a ship to get Elytra uh, within, uh, you know, like 1,500 blocks, incredible. So we're going to save these coordinates so we know where to come back and keep going. We were going on the Z coordinates. We were going positive on the Z coordinates, the negative, and... I'm going to come back in later and keep going that way. But for now, we've got that one Elytra. We've got shulker boxes. Uh, and that's what we wanted to accomplish this episode. Let's get back out. And uh, I don't really know what else to do this episode. I was expecting this episode to be a lot longer. Um, but um, I'm, I'm going to have to go find something to do for the rest of the episode now. So stick around and we'll be back. Since we have some extra time this episode, I think while I'm here, I've made my way back to where we came in from the gateway over in the void. I think while I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and clean this up and make a nice pathway out while I'm on this side of the gateway. Then when we get back to the main end island, I'll go ahead and fix up the gateway on that side also. So let me get into that. I'm going to have to gather up some end stone. Um, I don't have any building blocks with me, so I'm going to make it out of end stone for now. Uh, if they want it changed later, if the community wants it changed later, I'll come back do it differently. Uh, but for now, we're just going to go ahead and make it a little safer. That one wide pathway coming out, uh, it's a little shaky. Um, we're just going to go ahead and clean it up, make it look nice for everybody, and um, see what we can make happen. Stick around. We'll be back. Okay, so we made it back to the main end island, and we fixed up the port a little, little bit, uh, made it look a little bit nicer, and now I've got to test both sides. We fixed up the other side too, but i got to test both sides to make sure it's safe to travel through. Um, sometimes when you go through these gateways with these ender pearls, it can spawn you a little wonky, and you can fall to your death. So we're going to go through here uh, to the other side, and we're going to mark where that spawned us. So it spawned us right on that torch. So I want to mark where that spawned us just to see. Um, yep, so it spawns us on the lower. I think if we take all of this out, take all this island part out down here, 
and make it just this part up here and we can put the stairs going off this side I think it would spawn us up here actually uh, but I'm not sure about that oh no 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 go away dude all right come on you want to fight where you at where you at I'm trying to do something here I ain't got time for you I guess I looked at him I didn't realize I looked at him um, while I was building this I actually got a couple of them mad at me and we actually died um, and instead of going back to our bed in the end fortress, it actually put us all the way back at spawn. So I saw in the Discord the other day where beds are bugged right now. There's a lot of problem with beds and spawning and not working. And I think when we put that bed down in the end fortress, we actually put it up against the wall and we should have put it away from the wall one block. So when I got back, I moved it out just to see if it was going to help in case I died again. Uh, but for now, I want to show you guys what I did. Um, just made the pathway a little safer. We widened it out to three wide. We put some walls up on the sides. Um, that way you can kind of go through here and not worry about falling off. Um, I don't know if glowstone, I don't think we have. have a guardian farm on the server. Uh, but if we had some sea lanterns, I'd like to come in here and put some sea lanterns in. Oh, that was not good. Oh, that was not good. I was demonstrating by hitting, and I made an enderman mad. We're not going to make it. We're not going to make it. Oh, and my sword went over the side. But that gives us a chance to test our bed. So our bed works. Um, man, we lost that sword over the side. Oh, no, endermites. Endermites. Why are there endermites? Oh, I forgot to close the gate. Oh, definitely need to come in there and do something about the endermites. I don't want to break the, um, I don't want to break the spawner. I think somebody's got that set up maybe to do something with it later on. Um, we can build a platform up above it. That way when they spawn, they drop down below. Make a little kill box down there and we can kill the endermite. But going in there and having those things running all around on you is not good. So let's go back through and see how much of our stuff is actually <sighs> on the pathway. Let's see. Um, okay, I'm not sure what happened here. Um, did we spawn out into the infinite void and... Oh, I bet it was that wall. I bet it was that wall. When we spawned on that wall, I bet it glitched us somehow. Um, so we're going to have to log out of the game, come back in and see what happened. I'm sure when we come back in, it's going to say, you died. Um, so there's a lesson learned. Don't put a wall where you're spawning through the gateways. Um, that was not good. That was not good at all. So this may turn into a scientific experimentation episode. Um, I was just showing you guys the walkway. I was showing you where I was going to put the sea lanterns. I was hitting it with my chicken, and I accidentally hit that Enderman. And there we go. So we've got to get that wall out of the way. Let's not hit any more Enderman or look at them. So we got to move that wall so when we spawn in, um, whatever that was, wow, I think all of my stuff is gone. Nope, nope. I do remember seeing my sword go over the side, which is, err, that was a nice sword. It took us a long time to build all that up. So we got our pickaxe, our armor. Our bow, thank goodness, our bow. Uh, the sword can be replaced. There's our chicken. I think the only thing we lost over the side was our sword, and that was only because I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I just hit that enderman. Anyway, back to we were making the pathway sort of safe. 
And I was saying I would want to put sea lanterns in here to keep the Endermen from spawning on the path so you don't accidentally hit one of them and die. I guess I was thinking it and I actually decided to show you, but uh, we've been taking our end stone from over here. We made this a little safe area. Uh, we're going to grab some of this stuff. Like I say, this stairway might not be the greatest. The pathway may not be the greatest. Um, you can't run over the side. Even right here where you run up, you still don't run over the wall. I don't like the way the walls do that. It makes you feel like you're going to go over the side. Uh, I'm not sure if you jump if you'd go over the side, but we're not going to test that right now. Uh, and I wanted to put in little places so it didn't look like it was just floating. It looks like it's supported uh, by some supports there. The railing supported. Things that are just floating. Um, oh, nope, don't look up. And there's a lot of Endermen out there. This may be a good place to come and do an Enderman farm off in the void if you could get far enough away from everything or maybe just go out and mine out those few little islands around. Um, might go, uh, it might be a good place for an Enderman farm, I'm not sure. Um, but uh, we will take this wall out before we forget again. But we'd like to put some supports down from these so it looks like it's supported and not just kind of held up by this walkway. Um, we put the inner chest up here. back through and let's see I think we go back to the gateway and there we go so that is definitely not working so whatever I did I messed it up well that's why we test things after we do them uh, I put a pad up on there but apparently um, you don't spawn on the pad anymore. You used to spawn on the pad because over underneath that gateway is just air. There's nothing there. Um, I'm going to have to go back in and put a pad down below the gateway. Um, I guess it spawns you to the lowest possible point now. And if there's no point underneath that, it just throws you off into the void. So let me get that fixed. We'll test it again and we'll come back. <sighs> okay, we're back at the base and I have just realized something. Apparently, in me doing a nice thing and fixing up pathways for the community and stuff, apparently I kept one of my shulker boxes in my inventory because I only can find one of the shulker boxes that I made. I'm hoping by some dumb chance I left it in that end city. I'm gonna go back and check, but I'm pretty sure I had put everything in the end chest. Why I would have taken it out, I don't know. But apparently it was in my inventory when I got killed on that pathway by the Enderman. And not only my sword went over the side, but apparently the shulker box with the shulker shells, with the elytra, with the awesome armor that I found and the tools and the weapons, apparently it went over the side into the void also. <sighs> this has not been a good episode. It started out really great and it's gonna end really, really awful because all that, the whole episode, everything I did for the whole episode, getting the Elytra, the Shulkers, was for nothing because I'm an idiot and I kept the shulker box in my inventory when I was out doing dangerous work. Then I accidentally hit an Enderman because I'm stupid. Oh, man. We're going to just go ahead and end this episode here. And even though I don't feel like it, we're going to do a sad dance this time. We're going to end it by dancing, but it's a sad dance. I messed up the gateway. I lost my, all my shulker shells. I lost all the shulker shells, not to mention the elytra and the shulker box. Oh. I wish I could make little tears run down my cheeks. This is just so sad. We'll see you guys next episode. I don't even know what to say at this point. I don't even know what to say at this point. We'll get back in there and fix those gateways so when you spawn back, you don't automatically fall to your death before anybody else goes in. But uh, 
Oh, and we've lost our bow now too. That really cool bow. It just, I, it, I'm gonna go jump off a cliff somewhere. We'll see you guys next episode. Bye. Wait, cut, cut, cut. Don't end the episode yet. Don't go away yet. Guys, I just realized something. I went back after I was ending the episode and I pulled out the shirker box because I wanted to check how many diamonds I had because I've got to start building up tools and stuff. And when I looked in here, I realized we actually put the shulker shells in this box. So technically, all we lost was the tools, the armor, of course the elytra. The elytra is a big loss, but uh, we still have the shulker shells. I'm so happy. I'm so happy now. I'm so happy. So you guys know what that means. That's right. We can end the episode on at least a little bit of a positive note. Um, so we went back in. We fixed all the portals. The gateways, rather. We went through them. Uh, they all seem to be working okay now. Um, we have shulker shells. That means we can get shulker boxes. That's what we wanted. The elytra would be nice, but we don't really need to go traveling around with elytra. So we're just going to dance to end the episode. Makes me a little bit happier. Thanks for watching, guys. Dance with me. Come on. You know you want to dance with me. It's so much fun. Come on, dance with me. All right. We'll see you guys next episode. Thanks for watching. Yay, we have shulker shells.